Hey gang, welcome back. This is Captain Cowboy here with another video. We're going to be talking about yet another low spender guide. So, I was talking to Hem, sadly. It was painful. But, the best way to grow your account is 100% through the daily deals. Um, you're getting so much more benefit and more bang for your buck to slowly grind your way to um, you know, higher benefits. Another thing that you want to do is definitely get a um, subscription. And while subscriptions aren't, you know, it's not fantastic, it's also really well worth it. You're going to be getting a little uh, windowed conversion, which is awesome. Some march capacity. Um, and you're going to be getting some, you know, additional benefits all the time as well on a monthly subscription basis. That will help you grow. And it's not going to be fast growth, but it is slow growth. Um, and it is growth nonetheless. So if you're going to be, you know, slowly grinding your way through, spending like a dollar here and there, um, daily deals is probably going to be the best route to go for you. Um, 1,000 March capacity is not exciting whatsoever, I know. But it's something. It's more than nothing. And it's better than spending it on packs and not really being able to do anything because you're buying a dollar pack that really has nothing built into it. So if you're going to go ahead and buy some daily deals, obviously today these daily deals aren't the best route to go. Find out what you're lacking in the most. So take a look at your stats. So I'm going to take a look at my stats. I'm going to take a look. Um... Uh, Alright, so I'm lacking in troop health, troop defense, that's not really good. I don't want to lack there. Um, lacking again in my distance attack. So I want to go ahead and focus on my distance attack and my cavalry attack. So I would look across the board. I look at my gemstones, I look at my gear. My gear is where it has to be. My right, defense can go up, my health can go up, my attack can go up, like all these different things can go up. So I want to go ahead and focus maybe a little bit on my gemstones. Maybe some daily deals in the gemstones. Then let's go ahead and take a look at um, my coat of arms. Coat of arms. It's non-existent. So I can go ahead and spend a little bit of money on the daily deals on my coat of arms. I could go ahead and look at my curiosities. I don't have any curiosities. Go ahead and buy some daily deals for the curiosities. Like, you know, focus on what... Find out what you're lacking in first in stats. Second, find out, okay, where do I have the weakest part in this area? So, I have no curiosities. That's going to be the biggest place for me to get the most bang for my buck. Because I don't have any, or let's say they're all green, I can bring them all up to blue, whereas my coat of arms could be, like, say, purple. So, yeah, there's a lot of places that you can benefit and, you know, put money into where you're putting money in. Yeah, I know, I haven't spent money in, like, four months. I am slacking beyond compare. Um... But this is where you got to look at if to go ahead and get that extra edge up on the rest of your uh, competitors. So this is just a little deal, you know, not deal, but like guide on, you know, what's the best thing that you want to do with your account. So I thank you all for watching. If you have any questions on how you should be spending your daily deals, go ahead and ask. Um, also, if you are interested in trying to figure out what can you do with your account, don't hesitate to ask. I offer account guides. I can give you a really nice discount if you mention this video. It could be like 20% off, so instead of costing $10, it only costs $8. And an hour later, you'll know exactly what to do. You might even see stat increases immediately. Um, I might not have the best account, but I actually know how to utilize my account. So thank you all for watching this video.